strong as hell, and his face was covered with blood. My heart became so heavy when I viewed this awful sight, and I thought, oh, how cruel can they be? So I ran up the hillside to help this lonely man who had fallen to the ground ahead of me. I said, friend, can I help you with the burden? that you bear the blood stain I would freely wipe away then I saw a burden that he struggled to carry and I knew he carried sins that had brought him to the ground and I knew he carried it for me my sin that placed the crown of the Lord's own his head said, I'm doing this for thee. Amen. We certainly have a lot to be thankful for. And it's funny that even like in that song, that little story, it's, it's well represented in that we always think it's, we always think that we're pretty good. Yeah. And it's always somebody else. else. <laughs> it's always somebody else that needs to do better. Right. Because yeah. we do good. Mm. And people, they seem to think that being a pretty good person, well, that's going to get you to heaven. Don't work at that, Grace. Only... It's only those big sinners <laughs> that really need to fall down in tears and, and repent. Yeah. But you let's pray and I'll speak oh, a few okay. words and then we'll do our church work. And I'm thankful today that, that we've got enough sense about us to to understand that that we need Jesus for ourselves mm -hmm. and that we don't need to be looking around you know what the Bible says <clears throat> the Bible says that there is a generation that are pure in their own eyes oh, yeah. and yet is not washed from their filthiness <laughs> yeah, yeah. But in their own eyes, they do good and it's always somebody else that needs them. Uh, isn't that the way that those Pharisees talked to Jesus the whole time that he was here? Now that they were so convinced that he needed to come around to their righteousness and their way. Yeah. Because that, you know what? I'm sure that out in public, those Pharisees, uh, they got lifted up and, oh, yeah, and people, sure. they just glued and awed when they walked yeah. by. 
And I'm sure that they enjoyed those things. And how dare this little poor man, yeah. uh, this man, not even of the tribe of Levi, was he? Uh, right. uh, listen, how dare he uh, come to there and not give them uh, the reverence that they felt like that yep. they were due. Yeah. Uh, how dare this man uh, get all this attention uh, uh, from all these their people? Glory, yeah. uh, that the, uh, those people, they follow us. They don't follow that man uh, today. That yes. uh, and you know why you pray? Not just for a minute of time. Uh, you know, uh, old writer says a fool uh, hath no delight in understanding. And he doesn't, he's not seeking to understand no. truth, uh, uh, but his heart, uh, he, he delights, uh, and then his own heart, uh, uh, that his heart can uh, be satisfied yeah. with his own things uh, uh, today, yeah. uh, son, uh, he doesn't even seek the understanding of God, uh, uh, just like uh, uh, Jesus told them uh, uh, that uh, uh, they're ignorant to God's righteousness, uh, um, they, uh, they spend their time going about uh, uh, to establish their own righteousness uh, and being ignorant of God's righteousness. Uh, Allison here uh, today in praying and uh, just for a minute of time, you know what? I find myself like this uh, and sometimes I enjoy uh, uh, while I listen Oh, I, I enjoy when I get to be around a lot of brothers and sisters. I, I love talking about Scripture yeah. uh, with those that want to sit around after church and talk about Scripture. I, I love uh, uh, listening to Brother Sam talk. Uh, the son of me and him get talking about things. Uh, he can sure ask a lot of questions. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, I keep you thinking keep you think. uh, today. You know why? I know, and I love those things. I love I myself. I'm just speaking for me. I love to hear my brother get up and get down in the weeds sometimes. I enjoy those things. But you know what? Here's the other side of me. Oh, when I see one come in. Uh, listen, uh, and that obviously is feeling awkward uh, uh, coming around God's yeah. people. Uh, uh, when I see one come in, uh, uh, why that's timid and just looking for a little back row somewhere. Yeah. Uh, this, uh, yeah. uh, oh, my whole mindset begins to change. Uh, listen, and I say, Lord, Lord, uh, what can I say, God? Uh, what can we do, Lord, uh, to make them believe uh, that there's something worse driving them? Uh, oh, today. Now I read one place where uh, you know what Jesus came. Uh, he came to the lost house of Israel. Uh, he came to the Jewish nation there. Uh, oh, today uh, he came uh, debating in the synagogue. Yeah. Uh, 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 he stood them face to face there uh, and he turned their doctrine around. He sure did. Uh, he turned it right back around on them uh, and cut them to the heart. I'm an old um, but then I see uh, some, another side where uh, I read where uh, a woman came to him. I uh, was another household of faith. I nope. uh, was another household of uh, that nation. Jewish nation there. Uh, son, uh, oh, and uh, and she cried unto him uh, and followed him. Uh, Lord, Lord, have mercy. Uh, my daughter is sick uh, and I need help. Yeah. And you know what the Bible said? And uh, that Jesus didn't answer her. Uh, um, and he ignored her. Uh, <coughs> I went on about his business. Uh, uh, oh. And she followed him uh, wherever he went, uh, uh, calling on him. Yeah. And you know what? Um, uh, uh, the Bible says that his disciples finally came to him and said, Jesus, Jesus. Oh, you tell her to go away. Yeah. Uh, she's yeah. aggravating us to death here. Uh, oh. 
know what? Jesus knew what she wanted. Yeah. Didn't he? Yeah. Jesus knew them. Yeah. He came for the whole world. Yeah. He? he knew that there wasn't a sinner in this world that wouldn't benefit from him. Yeah. But you know what? And when his disciples called on him, Awesome. Uh, he turned to her and he told her, I'm not sent unto you, uh, but unto the lost uh, sheep of the house of Israel. Uh, oh, Lord. Uh, and she uh, cried unto him and fell down. Yeah. Awesome. And he said to her like this, and you think about this, <laughs> he said, is it me? Uh, is it right, uh, basically, uh, to take the children's bread uh, and to give it on no. to the dogs, the son? Oh, and she said, I know, Lord, uh, Lord, I know, uh, and I'm not worthy. Ask you, Lord. Yeah. Uh, uh, so she said, uh, But yet, yeah, Lord, the dogs eat of the crumbs yeah. uh, when they fall uh, from the table. Amen. Uh, my, uh, oh, Lord. Oh, I, and Jesus looked at her. He said, Great is your faith uh, today, uh, and uh, be it so unto you, yeah. uh, even as you ask of it. Uh, listen, and it says that and her daughter was made whole on uh, that very moment when Jesus spoke to her there uh, and you know what uh, people today uh, I'm telling you uh, we need to be about mercy here yeah. Uh, uh, we need to be about uh, uh, what's going to cause this world here. Uh, I don't want to call on the Lord. And, uh, uh, I spoke to that little boy, uh, that young man that was sitting back there last night. Uh, he sat by himself right there. Uh, and you know what? Uh, uh, no doubt he felt a little out of place uh, here. Uh, uh, really, he, he seemed to be the only one that wasn't a religious person. And I tried I to talk to him and I gave him a little hug there and, and I told him I appreciated him being here. Oh, son. Oh, and he said, I really enjoyed this and I want to come back and see you again. Oh, son. Oh, people, you know what? Oh, we don't know when. Oh, something we might say. Oh, uh, we just need to be about our fathers. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, I stopped Allison uh, the other night. I stopped uh, had been over at Brandon's house, uh, and I stopped at a gas station. Uh, just to give me a little something to drink there, uh, and, and it was nighttime, and, and I was waiting in line uh, to pay for my drink there. Uh, uh, oh. And there was a young woman in line in front of me. Uh, you know what? And I heard her say, uh, give me uh, five dollars of gas on, on this pump out here. Uh, and she went out and I paid for my, my drink there. And I turned around and started to leave. Uh, and I turned back around to that man there. And I said, did I hear her right? Uh, she wanted uh, five dollars of gas out there. He said, yeah, that's what she said. I said it ain't gonna get her very far. Oh, he said no, not at these prices. It's not. And I walked outside, Allison, and I and I thought about that, and and I walked out there to her. I didn't want to scare her. And you know one, and she was in an SUV there. And as I got up there, I see the child in the seat there. Oh, and she was just finishing. I just finished a pump of gas there. And, and I looked at her, I said, excuse me. I said, I don't mean to bother you, but did I hear you say, I was gonna put five dollars in your car? And she said, yes, I am. I said, it ain't gonna get you far in that thing. Oh, and she said, I know, 
but it's all I got uh, tonight. And I said, well, why don't we put a little more in it? And I just walked over and I put my card in there. And I, and, I, and I started pumping gas in her vehicle there. And listen, and I didn't really talk to her. I didn't want to scare Larry. Yeah. And in a minute, yeah. she come out of her car. And it was a young black woman. And she come out of her car. And she come over there. She said, can I give you a hug? And she said, I didn't know what I was going to do. <laughs> oh, yeah. She said, I don't know uh, what made you uh, uh, come over and help me. And I said, you know what? I just felt like it's what the Lord would have me do. Uh, yeah. And she just looked at me. Uh, oh, and you know what? And I started to leave there. And her car was on me. It took a whole lot of gas, Larry. And, uh, and that even worried me more. She, uh, she wasn't going very far. Uh, and I started to walk away. And she said, thank you so much. And I said, I'll go to church Sunday somewhere. And we'll call it even. Yeah. 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 Uh, some, uh, uh, oh, and I prayed that uh, uh, somewhere, sometime, yeah. Yeah. Uh, 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 when troubles come, uh, why uh, she'll think about uh, maybe uh, uh, the Lord sent her a little help one time. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, maybe uh, there's something to this thing they call God. Uh, maybe uh, Jesus is real today. Uh, I'm telling you that he is. Uh, oh, Without my Jesus, uh, he's everything to me. Uh, listen, uh, he's everything I want to hold on to. Uh, uh, people today, uh, uh, we've got such an opportunity with our little church here. Uh, uh, let's not let her get away. Uh, uh, let's open our church door uh, to this world here. Uh, and let's not, uh, let's not put judgment over the banner. Uh, oh, Uh, if my Lord, if he brought judgment uh, to this world, uh, then in 1979, I'd have been bound for hell. Uh, uh, he'd have sent me on my way. Uh, listen, I'm an oh, I was like uh, that little woman. Uh, Lord, I know I'm unworthy. Uh, Lord, I know uh, I've got nothing to bargain with. Uh, I'm an oh, Oh, are you talking about a sinner boy eating from the crumbs of the table? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, listen, uh, he fed me right that night. Yeah. Oh, God. Uh, listen, I'm glad uh, that uh, there's coming a day uh, when I'm going to lay my worries down. Uh, we're all going to lay our worries down. Yeah, Lord. Uh, oh, uh, but you know what? Until that day comes, uh, we've got work to do. Uh, we've got family. Uh, we've got neighbors. Uh, there's a whole world uh, that's uh, uh, hurting, Larry. Oh, and we need to be about our Amen. Father's business. Uh, uh, oh, aren't you glad uh, that uh, you're one in that number? Uh, aren't you glad uh, you're on the inside? Uh, why calling uh, for this world to come? Yeah. Uh, you know why? Read over our prayer list and one uh, look at uh, the family uh, that we put on the prayer list. Uh, look at the loved yeah. ones uh, that we have on have on there. Uh, but you know what? And and we put our sick on there, don't we? And we put those that are hurting. And uh, you know, uh, who we need on our prayer list is all those that don't yep. uh, profess a hope in yeah, Jesus. Uh, uh, oh, God. Uh, oh, I, I prayed uh, this morning uh, when Chad was leading us in prayer and, uh, and he mentioned uh, we had that boy on our prayer list. Uh, oh, 
God, if there's only I'm going to be one crumb. Uh -huh. oh, yeah. yes, Lord. Uh, Lord, I don't know where that boy is, yeah. uh, but Lord, I let it fall his yeah. way. Lord, yeah. 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 That was my prayer this yeah. morning. Yeah. And yeah. if you've got family, and I know you do, uh, uh, oh, uh, let's, uh, let's beg the Lord, yeah. uh, send a little angel. Uh, uh, why ain't give them some of those crumbs? Yeah. Uh, I'm not telling you, uh, if this world, if it gets a little taste of my Lord, uh, uh, listen, uh, they're going to want more. Oh, yeah. Amen to that. Uh, oh, I love what he's done for yeah. me. Yeah. He walks with me. And I want this world just to have a little bit of what I've got. Oh, I don't know. Larry, we don't know how long we're going to be in this no, world. We don't. Just like you were saying and that you was the young woman you yeah. came in. And last night I had a pretty good crowd. Yeah. And you were the eldest here, no doubt. No doubt. But we're going to leave. Mm -hmm. We're going to leave this way of life on for the next generation. Yes. If we're about our Father's business. Amen. Nice the torch. And if we're not, if we're just going to be spectators, mm. if that's all you want to be, well, serving so. God as a spectator, I feel Shame sorry on. for you. Yeah. Every